Hello students, welcome to Top Scholars. In today's video, we will know about Asia and its countries. Asia is the largest continent in size and population with approximately 44 million square kilometers covering nearly 30% of the Earth's land and 8.7% of its total surface area. It's separated from Europe by the Ural Mountains. Asia comprises 48 countries as per the United Nations definition. It is grouped into six regional divisions. Northern Asia, Western Asia, Central Asia, Eastern Asia, Southern Asia, Southeast Asia. First, let us know about Northern Asia. Do you know Siberia, also known as North Asia or Northern Asia? It is a 13 million kilometer square area in the Ural Mountains, Russia. It is bordered by the Arctic Ocean to the north, European Russia to the west, and the Bering Sea to the east. Internationally, it borders Kazakhstan, Mongolia, and China. Let us further know about the Western Asian countries. Western Asia comprises of 19 countries. It includes the Arabian Peninsula and Middle Eastern countries. All except Armenia, Georgia, Israel, and Cyprus have a Muslim majority with a total population of 282 million. Armenia, Azerbaijan, Bahrain, Cyprus, Georgia, Iraq, Iran, Israel, Jordan, Kuwait, Lebanon, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, the state of Palestine, Syria, Turkey, the United Arab Emirates and Yemen. Turkey is the most populous country in the Western Asia sub-region with a population of over 84 million. It is a transcontinental country with other transcontinental countries in Western Asia including Georgia and Azerbaijan. Cyprus is usually considered a European country from political and economic perspectives. It is even part of the European Union. Next are the countries that are located in Central Asia. It includes areas from the Caspian Sea to Western China comprising Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan and Uzbekistan which are predominantly Muslim nations. With an average population of approximately 75.3 million, it is the least populated sub-region of Asia. Now, let us know about the countries of Eastern Asia. It is a sub-region of Asia and has a population of nearly 1.7 billion and comprises six countries. They are China, Japan, Mongolia, North Korea, South Korea, Taiwan. China is the world's second most populous country and has a population of over 1.4 billion, while Mongolia has a population of 3.29 million. China and Japan are the world's second and the fourth largest economies respectively. China is expected to surpass the United States by 2028. While South Korea is flourishing, North Korea is a communist state with a stagnant economy. Now, let's look at the Southern Asian countries. It comprises of eight countries that are Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Bhutan, India, the Maldives, Nepal, Pakistan and Sri Lanka. This is the most populous sub-region in the world with a population of nearly 2 billion. India, the world's most populous country, has a population of approximately 1.4 billion, making it the most populous country globally. And lastly, Southeastern countries. Southeastern Asia comprising 11 countries that are Brunei, Cambodia, Indonesia, Laos. Malaysia, Myanmar, the Philippines, Singapore, Thailand and Timor-Leste and Vietnam with an estimated population of 673 million is primarily based on islands. Indonesia is the largest and most populous country and the least populous country in Southeastern Asia is the small Sultanate of Brunei. 
Do you know apart from Asia's 48 countries, three other Asian territories are Hong Kong and Macau and special administrative regions of the People's Republic of China which were originally part of China but were taken by European powers. Hong Kong was a British colony ceded back to China in 1997. and Macau was a Portuguese colony until 1999. Taiwan, a de facto independent state, is considered a province of China by most countries. With this we come to the end of this video. Try to answer the following questions. Question 1. Name the southeastern countries of Asia. Question 2. In which part of Asia is India located? Question 3. which is the most populous country of asia i hope you learned something interesting and enjoyed the video thank you and happy learning